hey guys welcome back so guys in this video we are going to learn about how to delete the data from database in laravel 8 so guys there are two methods to delete this data so let's get started guys with it so first let's move to our editor let me just close this unwanted files so guys this is my delete button which is visible over here in the red color and now guys let's work on it so first we'll work on with the first method direct url we will create and delete the data so let's tell delete employee forward slash call your id so what data you are going to delete that so let's copy this and paste that employee data so this employee data this record okay so this is the ids so whenever i click this delete button it should take this id and delete this row data okay as simple so now let's copy this route and create a path so let's use get method to delete this data oops paste forward slash the id and now let's call our controller so that is employee controller let's copy from the top employee controller at delete okay so let's copy this and create a function inside the employee controller public function delete delete and now let's create one variable called employee is equal to call your employee model model colon where i'm going to find that and after finding we need the id over here so what how you are sending id you are sending with this url thing right so let's call that dollar id over here and with this help of dollar id you are going to send over here done and after this you are going to call the delete function as simple and after that return and redirect back to home page so let's copy this and paste over here employee data deleted successfully let's save and now let's see this perfect let's get back let's refresh guys and now click to delete so let us see data is getting deleted or not click delete you can see employee data deleted successfully perfect so guys now let us see the second method to delete that using delete method okay so let's comment this and let's create one form and over here create one button delete type is equal to submit and then take the class to design this button so i'm going to just copy the same class method is equal to post and action we are going to take the same url so let's copy the same url paste over here and now over here you need to pass the csrf field that is token and then the method which we are going to use as delete as simple so this is the second method which we are going to see how to delete using delete route method okay so we need to send the id also not required because we are sending the id through this so let's get back on this web route so let's copy this and paste again and let's comment for this now for the reference let's keep it and let's change this to delete done and same url you are going to call at the same function let's go to the controller over here nothing to change just keep it simple let's save and now let's test guys let's refresh and i'm going to delete this om prakash data over here let's click to delete you can see data deleted successfully perfect so guys we have seen that how to delete the data in two methods so one is by form request and one is directly calling the url thing 
so guys in this video that's it so let's continue next video about new topic so guys thank you for watching this video please subscribe like and share